Okay, so how do we convert uh, handwriting to text? Let's have a look. Let's go into our quick sheets. Let's add a page and write something. It'll automatically put you into the page that you add. Um, so, Journaling 101, you can't manage what you can't name. Yep, it's a therapeutic tool for sure. Now let's see what happens here. First of all, you go back to grid view. Let's put down our pen. You select that page, press and hold. Your options up the top here are tag, convert to text, send, move, duplicate, delete. We're going to select convert to text down here, converting to text, English. A converted text added as a new page. And I can undo if I don't, if I want to, I don't want to. This is the new page. So let's tap on it. We tapped twice, tap again. Look at that. Journaling 101, you can't manage what you can't name. Now it's interpreted the the symbol I had like that, it interpreted, but hey, that's pretty fantastic. And you, you may be able to, to get a return in there. Um, yeah, it didn't interpret the new line, but that's okay. Look at that. Um, you can obviously tap to move it, go down a line and you know, start typing and do your thing. But I think that is pretty cool. Uh, when we go back to the grid view, you can see the new page and the page we created. Just for the exercise, let's delete them. Press and hold, pressing for three seconds. One, two, so what do we want to do with those two? We can do all of that. We want to delete them. And it's, are you sure? Yes, I'm sure. So we delete them and then give it time. Uh, sometimes it comes up with a syncing. If we go back here and we go out of the document there, watch what happens down the bottom. See here, it's got syncing and syncing. So it's really good to not expect that to be so instant because it's not instant and it can be a little frustrating if you don't allow time for it.